Boom! What's going on, everybody? How are we doing tonight? A wonderful, wonderful Sunday. Let me see if I can uh, let me bring up the chat. <laughs> hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me bring it up. Always fun with StreamYard. I like to see it down here on an iPad if you guys don't know how I do it. And there we go. Let me say hi, somebody. We will get to giveaways. So another one, and uh, Juliana from Geeky Mama Bear will join me a little later. And let's see where she's at right now because I think she's very close to 400. If you get to 400, then I'm going to give a mystery box away. So... Let me look real in. I think we before we're a couple away. All right. So she's at 384, guys. 16 more subscribers. Gets her to 400. And gets a giveaway of a $50 mystery box added to the popping candy. So moderators, if you want to link up Ginky Bomba Bear, guys, if you have not already subbed to her, go over, sub, and uh, we'll get an extra prize. You guys got to love that, right? Let's see. We'll say hi to some people, then we'll get to some giveaways. Uh, Donker three, Divine Pops. Mm, there's Quick Draw. Shout out Quick Draw. If you guys did not see it, Friday night on Quick Draw's channel, it was Batman Popster against Magoo Fitzfarter. It was one of the most entertaining battles I've seen in quite a long time. Magoo was in full character and costume. If you guys did not see it, go check it out. Uh, it was on Quick Draw's channel, so that's the channel it was on. I absolutely loved it. Magoo was dressed full Joker garb, and he scary Joker. I liked it. It was awesome. So shout out to Magoo. Shout out to Batman Popster, and shout out to Quick Draw for hosting that one. Can't wait to the next one. Oh, let's see. Tickles is in the house. Geeky Mama Bear is in the house. Again, we'll do the giveaways, and then I'll bring her on. And uh, JJ, congrats, JJ. That was an awesome pickup today from uh, the Spastic Collectibles drop. I saw it. I love it. Fabulous. And again, guys, if you are going to buy anything from Spastic Collectibles, remember, use code TACOMAN. Saves you 10% on everything but mystery boxes. So check that out. And it helps support the Taco Man himself. Hopefully everyone loved the live uh, duel yesterday with Pop Drunk. Pop underscore drunk underscore. Um, it was something else. It uh, has taken me majority of the night and the day to get over that. Uh, Sean said, if you're on keto and you drink, it's going to bad. It really does you in. And I, it, it, it did. It did. It was hard. It was hard. Thank you. Thank you. Yes, yesterday was a lot of fun. Um, I made it upstairs. I played a little one-on-one -on -one basketball game with my son somehow. And I gave my daughter a bath and I got in and got her hair done. And that's where it was. It was lights out. The next thing I remember, I wake up on the floor. Look, actually, I woke up and it was all dark. The door was shut. It was totally dark. I didn't know where I was. And then I look up and see this green light. And it's like, oh, my goodness. And then I woke up and I popped on to booze and pops for a little while. And I was really out of it at that time. But uh, and it was late. It was late. But yes. Uh, but mystery boxes, tons of mystery boxes coming, guys. Should be a fun week. Tomorrow, a really cool a video that I actually shot a while ago, but uh, finally getting around to posting it out. We're going to talk grails from Kiwi Couple over in New Zealand. They sent me, uh, I bought some stuff from them, so that will be a video feature tomorrow. We have Smy World box coming on Tuesday, and uh, I'm trying to think what Thursday is. I can't remember what Thursday is. I have it in the, in the queue. I just got to remember what it is. But yes, moderators, if you want to pop up again, Juliana's channel, Geeky Mama Bear, currently right now at 384 subscribers, 386, 14 away. We'll do that as one of the last giveaways. If you get her to 400, I will give away a $50 mystery box. Winner's choice. There's cheap and nerdy, probably Brittany. How are you doing, Brittany? Hopefully you guys enjoyed the con. I saw some of the pictures. Looked like a lot of fun. All right, but we have some giveaways to start with. So first off, if you watched the video from Tuesday, which was, again, a big one of the big Tuesdays we do, 
uh, there was a giveaway built into that. And it was for good old Dipper Pines from Gravity Falls. I know a lot of people reached out and said, Gravity Falls, Gravity Falls. If you don't remember Gravity Falls, it was a Disney XD show that ran from 2012 to 2014. It was quite enjoyable. I, I actually liked it. It was I watched my son loved it. I watched it, and uh, I am one away from the whole set. So um, when I found it, it's just uh, I need the regular uh, Mabel, and people went like over PPG for it, and there and there's even some damage to it. So I, I won't do that. So that's the last one I need. But let me uh, let's bring up that video. And uh, we're going to give away a Dipper Pines as long as you hashtag, uh, I think it was hashtag your favorite Gravity Falls character. Or it was hashtag Gravity Falls. One or the other. Uh, yeah, hopefully you guys like the battle with Sean on Thursday. It looks like that's what we'll do again this week. We'll be on Thursday. It'll be on his channel. So uh, stay tuned for that one. And we've got a good response. So a lot of people would love to see the Pop Drunk 3-Way again. Um, give us a couple weeks to recover. <laughs> Ed went out and uh, door dashed, I think, like $80 of McDonald's food afterwards. And he watched AEW. And uh, yeah, he, he mostly probably relaxed most of the day. Uh, they did hop on booze and pop so for a couple hours, though. They did do that. All right. Let me bring this up. What's going on, guys? It is the Lou Adams. Turn down the sound. We will get the, uh, the link and we'll hop into it. And this will be the first giveaway of the night. Remember, guys, moderators, post. Yes, there it is. DJ Funko Pop Hunter. We'll check it out. Was 14 away. Let's see if we can get her to 400. You know I always like to give mystery boxes away. Winner's choice. All right. Here we go. And let's see if we have. Do we have... Hashtag Dipper Pines on here. And how about that? It is DJ Funko Pop Hunter. Nice pools. Awesome. Crystal Freddy. Cool video. Ugh. So Dave did not put the Dipper Pines. So he might not have seen that. So again, we will do it again. Remember, you have to have hashtag. One of the hashtags. Let's see what it is. Or did I do the wrong one? <laughs> Hold on, guys. I think I did the wrong video. I'm telling you, I'm still recovering. I'm still recovering. Took a lot out of me. I did. I did the wrong video. My fault. It was Monday's video. <laughs> I'm telling you. Seven shots did me in, especially like Skullhead Crystal Vodka. I'll tell you a story maybe one of these days about that. I have history with Skullhead. All right. So here we go. Now I have the right video in. All right. So we got 48... All right, remember, you have to hashtag Gravity Falls or your favorite character, one or the other. We have Blake Asbury, who uh, said, all my friends keep telling me to watch. Hashtag Gravity Falls. I'm going to try and get through it this weekend. So Blake Asbury, Asbury uh, hit me up on Instagram. Let me know your shipping address. And Dipper Pines is on his way to you. Uh, and yeah, check it out. It is a very cool show. I know Amazon has the whole set, and I believe you could probably watch it on Disney Plus. I think I haven't checked that, but again, it only ran for two years. So, but a very, very cool show. Uh, my favorite character, um, probably Grunkle Stan. So, I love it. And Grunkle Stan came to me. I actually bought one, and in the midst of the guy shipping it, uh, I got one in a mystery box two weeks ends with two weeks ago with Sean. So, shouts out to Chrono Toys. All right. So, Blake, first winner of the night. Uh, again, guys, don't forget, go support Geeky Mama Bear. Get her to 400. I'd love to give a mystery box away. Now, let's get to the weekly giveaway. Then, we'll hop into Juliana's giveaways. And then, she'll come join me. All right. Here we go. Let's look at the weekly giveaway and we'll go through them uh also guys thank you so much to all the subscribers and everyone like that we hit 3k next sunday we will do it it will be the 3000 subscriber giveaway and uh someone is gonna win big um there'll be some bonuses probably 
So the three thousand, we're talking three hundred dollar mystery boxes, one year subscription services, three hundred dollar PayPal credit, uh, three hundred sneaker stock stock X. If you guys like the sneaker stuff, or you could choose a three hundred dollar Grail. Either way, um, it's like a three hundred dollar prize. I've decided we'll probably will do one waffle raffle next week. I will also add a Patreon uh, giveaway next week to anyone that is a patron of my channel. It'll be a special giveaway to you guys. Probably will be a mystery type of box. So if you guys want to become a taco, yes. Yes, we all know if Sean wins next week. Um, I, I guess I'm going to get a $300 Taco Bell gift card, <laughs> which is doable. I asked the girl. She looked at me really weird, but said, yeah, I think we could. Yeah, I mean, sure. Why not? We could do it. So anyway. This is for the weekly this week. We have the DC Pop and Tea of Catwoman, the Jim Lee. Uh, very cool, the black and white one with the t-shirt pack. We have a Dragon Ball capsule. Uh, again, doesn't have the chase in it, but we have that. You could have the Luau Chalice style mystery box. Six pops, two of our uh, exclusives, uh, just like Chalice does. We have that one. How about a Luau, Luau anime mystery box? the $30 PayPal credit or a Luau anything box. And what that is, is it could be autographed items. It could be anything I get from any of the boxes you see me open. There could be a pop in there. There could be a mystery mini. There could be a t-shirt. Anything goes. So those are the options this week. Remember, we picked two winners. First winner gets to pick out of the six. Second winner gets to pick out of the five. Then I'll pick a come on live winner for next week if you guys want to join me. Mama J, what is going on? Yes, all the new videos are out tonight. So the new weekly giveaway will be out. And the 3,500 subscriber giveaway will be out. Uh, bonus will be on May 1st. If we can hit 3,500 by May 1st, uh, as Magoo and a lot of people say, I like to go bananas. And uh, I will. Um, there are $350 prizes right now. If we hit it by May 1st, I'll do two winners at $350, and then I'll do two winners, I think, at $100 gift cards or stuff. So I'll go bananas with giveaways. May 1st is the, the bonus. But those uh, videos will be out tonight around 10, 10, 15. All right. Here we go. So we have 87 comments in the weekly winner. Remember all the prizes. Here we go. Winner number one is going to be... Pops with purpose. Michael and Faith saying, I'm the king. Looking forward to the live and always love and highlight the smaller channels. Michael and Faith, congratulations on that one. Uh, hit me up. Let me know which one you want. And away we go. I didn't see them in here. Not saying they aren't. Pop and Son Pops, what is going on? Divine Pops, how are you? Mitch Hayes, DJ Funko Pop Hunter. So, Michael and Faith, congratulations on that one. Tell me which prize you want, and uh, away it goes. Also, uh, for anyone that got their mystery boxes, fabulous mystery boxes. I think they were $40 shipped, and the value was uh, bananas. So you've seen a couple channels open them. Um, yeah, actually, that was what Magoo and uh, Batman Pops were doing. So, uh, sh shouts out to them. Cool, cool, cool stuff. Great value. All right. Ready for pick winner two. And winner two is going to be um, MC Wig Splitter. <laughs> I like the name. I have a feeling that Lua Everything Mystery Box is going to be mine this week. And it very well could be. In fact, even if Michael and Faith do it, I probably could do two of them. So if that's what you want, MC Wig Splitter, let me know. Hit me on Instagram. Um, let me see if I could do it like Heather. It's the underscore Luau underscore 23. <laughs> I love it. I love it. You guys all had her doing it a couple times last night. Uh, it was a lot of fun. And a lot of you guys really seem to like it. So um, I think when all of us recover, maybe in a, a month or so, we'll do it again. All right. So we're up to picking the Come On Live winner. Remember, it's a gift you can exchange. You can give somebody. Uh, Ness won it last week, but was just happy to have Juliana come on. So that's cool. There it is. Thank you, Larry. All right, here we go. The Come On Live winner next week is going to be Craig Utley. So Craig Utley, great channel, awesome giveaways, one of the best on YouTube. I appreciate it, Craig. So Craig, next week, if you would like to come join me, 
it's totally up to you. Feel free. And um, we can have some fun. Or if you want to pick somebody, I will try to get them on. Or you can ask them. That's cool, too. It's whatever you want to do. All right. So let's see. We're up to checking out Geeky Mama Bear and seeing where we are at. So, we are at 391, guys. Nine more to go. Can we do it? 391. Come on. Nine more to go. I know you guys can do it. And did I see my work buddy, Steve Kitchen? I think I saw him in the chat. Shouts out to Steve Kitchen. He actually has a YouTube uh, video. An older one that has a lot of views. Give away a trip to Hawaii. Wow. Uh, no. <laughs> I'm generous, but not that generous. Wink Inc., what is going on? And guys, you want to see? Go check out Wink Inc. Great channel. Great channel. And love his uh, his little logo. What you see, his icon there, it sits behind him. Uh, I love it. Great channel. Go check out Wink Inc. Elizabeth Mazak, what is going on? So come on, guys. Nine away. But uh, I'm going to start it up because already we did hit a popping candy. And you guys know how uh, we all love the popping candy, right? All right. So let me get it. Mm -mm -mm -mm. All right. There's the video. And let's share. Copy the link. Remember, you have to have hashtag the Luau sent me to be entered into it. And while I'm doing this, there we go. Three away. Five away. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Get it to 400. All right. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Paste, paste, paste. All right, so we have 102 comments. Remember, you have to hashtag the Luau sent me. Steve wants to win his first pop one here. Well, you never know. You never know, Steve. One of these days, maybe you could come join me. Anyway, uh, are we ready? This is going to be for, well, let's see. Let's see if we can get her to 400, and then we'll do the bigger win first, which would be a $50 mystery box. All right, let's see. Come on, come on, 397. Three more to go. I know you guys can do it. <laughs> Don't say that, Bradley. It's, she's a great channel. A lot of fun. Come on. Three away. Two away. It's two away. One away. Come on. One more. 400. It's one more. It's all it takes. One more. You guys have a shot at a mystery box. I'll even do one if you want. Or you can pick a store. All you have to do is comment on that video. It is um, a gift from f uh, a friend and a giveaway win from a week ago. That is her video to comment on. We are one away. Come on. Come on. Did we hit it? Did we? Did we? Everyone's saying yes. Yes. All right. There we go. So you guys are saying yes. Close enough. I'm with it. Let's do it. All right. So let's load it up. Remember, you have to have hashtag the Luau sent me to be entered into it and to win. And again, we have 103 comments. So this will be for the $50 mystery box. Then I'll pick the popping candy because you guys said you want to do big ones. So everyone has a shot at winning big ones first. So I like that. I'm with it. Here we go. $50 mystery box. Winner's choice. Who's it going to be? Uh, Bradley Basiak. Hopefully I'm saying it wrong. Uh, right, Bradley, I hope. Uh, subscribed. Hashtag the Luau sent me. So, Bradley, congratulations. Right there it is. Bradley, you are the winner. $50 mystery box. Hit me on up on Instagram. Let me know how you want to do it. You want me to do one. You want to pick one from one of the other companies. I'm totally cool with whatever you want to do. Um, just hit me up and let me know. He just got kicked out. <laughs> God. I would hope he was just joking, guys. But Bradley, congratulations. You did win. All right. So let's do a, a pop and candy. And I, I'm liking it, guys. I'm going to make sure it is a stickered pop 
an exclusive with the candy. You know how it comes in a box filled with candy. And uh, yeah, I have some good stuff. That's good stuff. A new Twix. How about uh, cookies and cream Twix? Yogurt covered Skittles. I have that. We have some chewing gum from Wrigley. Uh, and the normal stuff, Milky Way and all that good stuff. All right. So here we go. That is for the pop and candy. That winner is going to be. Winner is Super Mutant 2099. Hashtag the Luau sent me. So Super Mutant, hit me up on Instagram at the underscore Luau underscore 23. <laughs> I just love it. Shouts out to Heather and Pop Drunk. And uh, yep, we'll do it. Also, big shouts out to Completely Corey. I know a lot of people ask me about the intros, the outros. That is done by Corey. So uh, shouts out to Completely Corey. I know he works, so he's not on right now. But uh, shouts out to him. All right. Are we ready to bring on Juliana and Geeky Mama Bear? You guys ready? Have questions for her. I don't know. She says she's making a list, so I don't know. I might be intimidated what she might ask me. Jeez. But are you guys ready? A one, a two, a three. Boom. Hey, guys. <laughs> Welcome. Thank you. And I congratulations. Awesome. Brother. Yeah. Great little milestone. Yeah. The one guy, that one guy, he unsubbed, but that's fine. Ah, we can expect that. <laughs> it happens. Oh, yeah. well. His loss. <laughs> His loss, absolutely. I, I love your channel. I think you do great stuff. I love the background. I love bringing the kids in. A lot of fun. Yeah, the kids. And I like the like t-shirt. Oh, thank you. I made it myself. Really? Yes. I like that. I make everything myself. <laughs> very cool, very cool. I made some new stickers. I like, I like them. And I made different sizes. Ooh. All right. <laughs> you know, when you show people shirts and stickers, you're going to have to put them out there where people are going to want them. Yeah, but since I'm, I'm making the whole thing myself, like I press them, I do everything. Oh, wow. It'll take a little while. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Maybe I, did, I should do the, the spring thing. It's easy. Just up yeah. the, update the logo and poof. Yeah, easy. I might do that. I don't know how many people would want to buy it. <laughs> you might be surprised. I did have a person at Walmart ask me about it. Yeah, they bring a lot of questions. Yeah, I try to get not everyone, but I people that had the shirts. I try to get some and support and yeah. Give them a I like wearing other shirts. Yeah, it's it's, good. it's all good. I don't know. I think I said hi to everyone. Hi everyone. <laughs> <laughs> So right. what, what what's new? What's going on with your channel? New things coming up? Anything like that? So I do have a bunch of things in here, <laughs> but I was always the type of person who was I, I'm a perfectionist. So if I know it's gonna be it's not gonna be perfect, I ended up not doing it. <laughs> I have this idea of uh, bringing the pops and not just showing the pops and talking about the pop, but bringing the whole history of the character. I like that. Yeah, but it's like I keep putting it on paper, and I'm like, no, it's not perfect yet. And uh, I don't know. I might have to do it just like my first video. I was like, first of January, I'm gonna post a video. Then we were in Florida, and I was like, man, I need to post a video. So we were in the in the hotel, and I was like, I need to shoot a video now, and post. <laughs> And I just did it. I was like, no, nah, oh my gosh, it's not perfect. I don't have an intro. I have nothing, but it's gonna have to be. Sometimes that, that that they turn out to be the best ones. Yeah, and because I was like, if I don't do it, I'm gonna keep thinking, I need this, I need that, I need, you know? So I was like, I just I just need to post a video. It's gonna be a start. Yep. And it was great and I met a lot of people. This community is amazing. They are. Yeah. They are. Yep. Yeah, they're, they're great supporters. And never felt more at home. <laughs> <laughs> yep, it is uh, It is an awesome community. And you, you meet some very interesting people. Yes. And some people I like, <laughs> which is good. Yep, yep, yep. 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 Not everyone will like everyone, but they. I think everyone respects everyone and they get along. So yeah, yeah. it works out. Every now and then you have the, the occasional things, but. Oh, yeah, that, that's okay. I, I I got into this knowing that you know you're gonna have dislikes. You're gonna have people talking bad about you. Oh, so yeah. What you gonna? It happens. Do? it happens. I always think is their loss. 
So yeah, people that take the time to watch a video and, and hit you with a dislike, at least they're, you know, they're watching. Oh yeah. Yeah. That's okay. Thank I you. haven't got a, a dislike yet, but I'm well, gonna, yeah. no, it's coming. <laughs> <laughs> I know it's coming. <laughs> it happens. It happens. Yep. No yep. So yeah. Hit me with the questions. <laughs> uh, let's let's see. Well, let's let's see. What is like your number one? I, I see some ad icons back there. Yes, in fact, the ad icons. Because I think I told everybody my story already. I started collecting back in 2011, 2012. I knew nothing about it. I just thought it was cool. So that's why I have a lot of the you know the old ones. Yep. Uh, because I started buying what I liked. Yep. But. I had one kid and I start. I, I was still working, but the second kid, I had to stay home. So I stopped my collection in 2014. So I missed out on all the ad icons, everything. <laughs> so when, when I went back to work, I was like, okay, what's new? And I was like, oh, I missed out on this. So this is, I, I haven't even buying like the, the Star Wars. Yep. I'm, working, I'm working on these and the office. Um, oh, but cool. I do have a whole, I think I have 130 Star Wars pops. Wow. And that, that's a huge set, especially if you. Yeah. They're not here because they have their own little shrine. <laughs> oh, yeah. yeah. So those are the ones I like. I like uh, Masters of the Universe, all the old Ooh. ones. Yep, Masters of the Universe. Uh, I have the Thundercats. That's a cool one. Yeah. There, there are some awesome ones too. All the old ones, I, I'm looking into getting the gummy bears, the new Masters of the Universe, finishing the collections that I started. I think and you have one question. They were curious, what was your first pop? Girl Power. Oh, very cool. Yeah. <laughs> That's an awesome one. Yeah, and everybody, I, I also collect um, Marvels, but it's like, it's in, it's not the priority right now. I have it's, some old ones. How about uh, your favorite Star Wars pop? It's not, it's not a very expensive one, but it's Anakin as a kid. Okay. Yeah, I think it's, it's, cool. so, it's so cool. It looks so cute. But there's so many. I don't know. That one is just because when someone asks, it, that one comes to mind. Star Wars is. I, I didn't get into Star. I love Star Wars, but I didn't get into the. There's just too many. <laughs> it's too many. Oh, Elizabeth wants me to speak Portuguese. There is no Brazilians in the chat, so. <laughs> <laughs> no, <thank you. laughs> Everybody's gonna think I'm crazy. <laughs> Do you have any Rick and Morty? Um, I think I do. What was it? Because I haven't started yet watching, but I got one, Mr. Me6. Okay, yeah. That's the only one I have. Because I am going to start watching the show, and uh, so I just kept it. It came in a, in a mystery box. That's cool. Yeah. Well, here, Craig is asking you, what is your most expensive pop? Um, I showed it on the Dr. Applesauce. Uh, it's actually Shira. Which is a cool one. That is a cool one. She is worth uh, $340. But I, I paid $8. <laughs> <laughs> so. Yeah, I think a lot of people really wish they were collecting these back in uh, 11 and 12. Yeah, so Ace High asked about the book, uh, the bookcases. They're from Walmart. They're thirty dollars each. <laughs> Can't Great. beat that. Can't beat that. No. And it is a good background. I can see what a Michelangelo. I see. Yeah. Oh yeah. I have. I have so many. Deadpool's. Ace Ventura. Oh yeah, I love Deadpool. Oh yeah, a Ace Ventura is one of my favorites. Yes. This is, it's also an expensive pop, but I, it I is. Like it. that was one of my favorite movies ever. He is, he is a tough one to come by these days in, de in even decent condition. Oh, yeah. He's in, these pops, they went through four moves, but they're fine. They're, they're, <laughs> they're 
have a few that you know have some things, but I, I don't care. They're not leaving my collection. Yeah, it happens. It happens. You gotta love them. Um, how many pops deep? It's three rows deep. Wow, that's actually that's a nice book case. Yeah. yeah. I actually keep thinking I'm gonna, you know, switch up a bit so people can see the other ones, but I never get to it. <laughs> I get so many questions about this. Hey, do you? I said, I do switch them. You just may not see a video in a video that'll keep switching all the time. Yeah, but, yeah, it's hard. Yeah, and they switch because sometimes I I look at ones and I'm, like, oh, I'm not attached to it. I well, don't see. Yeah. So the the pops that I really want are the ones that I missed out. It's not even for value. It's because two pops, Tony the Tiger, any Tony the Tiger, but it has to be the four inch because I only have 10 inch Star Wars. Okay. And Toucan Sam. Okay. Yeah, those are. Toucan the is, uh, it, I, I have that one and the metallic and I, I love them. It's just such a unique pop. Yeah, and I tried to get the metallic. Oh, it's, it was impossible. It was impossible. It was I impossible. didn't care that it was metallic. I just wanted one. <laughs> Within like a minute of it, it was gone. It was like, poof. Yeah. Oh, yeah. There was no chance. It was really fast. It, it was. Really it was. But he's gone down and he's gone down in cost and he wasn't too bad. But yeah, I liked him. Yeah, um, Ace Ventura, he's probably high on my list. And uh, I need the metallic monsters, Sully. That's pretty, that's high on my list too. So, uh, Elizabeth wanted to know if I collect anything other than Funko Pops. I do. I collect um, Star Wars Hot Wheels, Ooh. Um, Star Wars Funko um, uh, Legos. I collect Pop Heads and anything that you can think. <laughs> <laughs> I have to just stop collecting. My husband's like, we have to buy a new house just for your stuff. <laughs> it happens it happens you fall down that rabbit hole and some of us there's certain ones like i don't mess with pez i had to get the the toy story ones from this last week but pez is something i stay away from and then uh thank you to pop couple they got my kids into tiny ghosts so. <laughs> oh i'm staying away from those seriously staying away from they get addictive i mean they haven't tweaked me enough i kind of like the the chomp things i think they're kind of cool the abominables uh i like them but yeah, they, yeah, tiny ghosts, and they had to get the society thing, and uh, it's it's blame pop couple. Yeah. Oh, Fritzy said I, I best collect a new husband now. <laughs> 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 um, Jeremy, uh, doing mystery box. I don't have, I don't have enough for mystery boxes. Um, all, most of the pops in my collection, I want to keep. That's yep. that's being an issue for me because I need to, you know get rid of something so I can get more mystery boxes, but I can't seem to get rid of anything. It's hard. <laughs> you look at me like, do I need this collection? Or, oh, I don't know. Yeah. Yeah. I, I do it. All, I do it all the time. I go through, I went through them about a week or so ago and I still, I, there's not many I got rid of. Um, <laughs> Car Carmen asked me a uh, favorite chase pop. I don't, I don't have a favorite. I know one that I want, like I really want it is the natural Libra chase. Okay. That's the only chase that I really, really want. Because the other one was number five from um, Umbrella Academy, and I got it. <laughs> yeah, there's a good bit of chases. We all like to play that chase roulette game. I'm not, I'm not really lucky with those. <laughs> I, 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 I got I, unlucky. I shot a whole video, <laughs> and I didn't get a chase. So I was like, I'm not putting this video out. Seriously? Didn't get the chase. <laughs> Yeah, it, it, it can it can hurt sometimes, especially if you really want the chase. Yeah. Oh yeah. It was for the Jim Halpert uh Facebook. Okay. But I actually ended up buying him from uh what was uh G Pop Pops. Mm-hmm. Grandpa Pop. I, I tell him I call you Grandpa Pops. G Pop Pops. Yeah, he sent me a sticker and I was just sitting there the video's not out, but I was struggling with the G Pop Pop. I, I was like, Man, it's messing me up. I know. I said I wanna say Grandpa Pops. Yeah. It's just G pop pops. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> yep, cool guys. What well, pop would like to see made? Um, Andy Bernard with bleeding bleeding nipples from uh, 
from The Office. There is a scene where they're running a 5K and his nipple starts bleeding through his shirt and they never made it. So I wanted to see that. <laughs> they, they, they really love their office pops. Oh, yeah. I need to get all of the ones that came out. <laughs> so much so, uh, like, I like Dark Pearl Originals, which they do. It's, it's just an autograph. He gets autographed Funko Pop signed. Okay. And he did one with Kevin Malone. Oh. That's holding the pot. Oh, I, I need to get that one. Sold yeah. out in like five hours. Oh, wow. I, was, I was waiting on. I was like, I normally, you know, he's it's doesn't his stuff. His stuff doesn't sell it like that, but five hours gone. <laughs> so fast. Yeah, yeah. And I, I've never I've watched bits and pieces of it. I've never sat down and watched The Office. I think I'd like it, but yeah, I haven't. Well, I, it I don't know. You might not like it because I finally got my husband to watch, and the main character Michael Scott. He's a douche. <laughs> <laughs> he doesn't know he's a douche. <laughs> he, he's the nicest guy ever. Yeah. And my husband's like, I'm not watching this. This guy's really bad. He's mean to everyone. And I'm like, that's the fun part of it. That's what's funny. <laughs> so it depends on if you like that. <laughs> oh yeah. I, I like I like I like his character, so I think I'd probably be alright. But we'll have to see one of these days I have to sit down and watch. Yeah, you should. It's really funny. Um Elizabeth asked if they made a tiny ghost of Star Wars. Maybe not. Maybe if they did a Doctor Who one, I would get it. That's a cool one. <laughs> yeah. Any spots? Did I grab a Toy USA box? Uh, no, I haven't bought a Toy USA box in a well since the big one, but uh, I haven't got another one. I did grab one. I grabbed one. That I have a week, week ten damage challenger or something like that, right? Yeah. That's some cool. They always have cool ones. Yeah, and it was I think it was mostly um Star Wars pops for Yeah, they have some Star Wars. They they really did a cool one yeah. maybe a month ago it was all Star Wars, like eight boxes, ten boxes, all Star Wars. Which was cool. Um, Tara, I don't do many mystery boxes. Um I've I've tried a few. I don't know, I like Toy USA because I'm not really like I don't need perfect condition pops. So I like them. Yeah, they have great value with their damage box. Yeah, yeah. Ace high pick. Yeah, one hundred fifty dollars Pop King Paul box. Yep, that's coming. Um, Carmen asked if I do. I have any sports pops? No, and I'm gonna cause friction right now. If I was to get one, I would get Tom Brady. <laughs> Nobody likes Tom Brady here, <laughs> but I do. I do. I think he's he's a great. He, he's one of the greats, without a doubt. Yeah. Yeah. Hopefully he he, uh, he smartens up and doesn't go to another team. Yep. We'll see. I don't think they'll let him leave, but you never know. Fritzy, Fritzy said, a friction achieved. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he brings a lot of hate. Well, I am from New England, so. Okay. <laughs> Nothing wrong with that. I'm, I, I, I love the Red Sox. Uh, would you rather never buy another pop or start collecting from scratch? Hmm. Um, never buy another pop, maybe because I don't. I don't know if I would ever get these ones back. I keep thinking I need to put, you know, these in insurance or something because <laughs> the kids and the husband I can get get out of the house, but these I would. <laughs> <laughs> there's a fire or something <laughs> yeah yeah you, i mean you definitely have quite the collection um fox i'm from connecticut what else how about what what pop are you looking for any pops you're looking forward to eccc of course what two weeks away um i am looking forward uh to the office pops I have been to three different Walmarts because everybody keeps getting the Dwight as a Recyclops. Yep. They keep showing pictures and I'm like, I went to three different Walmarts and I can't find it. Not there. So these guys are there and some stores probably just aren't allowed to bring them out yet. And then some stores just are. Yeah. I would think because technically it, it shouldn't come out until what, whatever the Friday of the con is going on. Yeah. I think, I think here they're really strict about that. Because yeah, some stores are. 
on Friday, I did go to Target, um, Target Con, and they had a bunch of Star uh, uh, Office Pops out. Yep. And I started grabbing them. I'm like, oh my gosh, I need these. And then I went to the register, and she's like, nope, three nine. So I don't know. It should be three thirteen. Thirteen yep. Friday. So I don't know why she said three nine. I might go there on the ninth and say, listen, can you go to the stock and pick these up for me? <laughs> Maybe I'll do that. <laughs> I think yeah. yeah, the so sodas are cool, guys. I, I like the sodas. I actually have some down here that I opened up. Um, they're cool. They're cool. Oh, I'm not. I'm not really opening that can of worms. That <laughs> can of worms. <laughs> they're no. they're different. They're different. There were yeah. certain ones I wanted. Loving the add icons and things like that. I had to get a few. Yeah, I would I would want many of those, so I'm not starting. <laughs> oh yeah, Masters of the Universe. Oh yeah. Lion O. Lion O, yes. Momra, I think, yeah, Momra or Momra. I'm I'm thinning out my collection, but um DC I'm still collecting um Jokers and Batmans. Um, so I would want Batman. I, I can't wait for the uh the Jack Nicholson Joker. That's one of my favorite ones coming. Um, Elizabeth asked about fig pins. I do collect pins, all the pins. Um, fig pins are also in the collection. I actually got two um, Deadpool ones from um, one of the boxes, uh, Ferrer boxes. Yep. And then uh, Elizabeth sent me the the other two that I didn't have, so I completed that one. It was a uh, Deadpool through the years, like 50s, 60s. Yep, 70s. I remember that one. So yeah, I got those. Flintstones. Um, the Flintstones, I I got Betty and Wilma, but I don't have any of the other ones. So I might just get rid of Betty and Wilma. Yeah. I have too many collections to complete. <laughs> I want to collect everything. I'm with you. I'm with you. It's hard. Yep. It is hard. And do you collect Mandal the Mandalorian? Yes. But I did not get the one with the gun. I feel so bad because I could have gotten, and I was like, oh, I'll get it later. It's not going to be, you know. So now this time I went to Target and I got three of the, <laughs> of the flamethrower one. That is a cool one. Yeah, it is a cool one. Even with Marvel, I think I'm going to thin out only the Avengers. All the rest, I'm going to just get rid of it because it's too much. I thinned it to Captain America. Unless there's something, and I, I have a few Iron Man that I like, but Captain America was my big one that I kept. Mm. And uh, it, it's always tough. It's always, and I seem to like the older ones than I like the new ones. <laughs> it happened. Yeah, I used to love X Men, but I don't. I don't know. It's not big anymore. So. Mm -mm. You see some here and there. I mean, supposedly they're going to bring them back in some some kind of movie or some some yeah. way. Yeah, but I need to thin out. <laughs> it's too many. It's hard. It's hard. And my husband watches the videos, and he's like, hmm, another $150. <laughs> and I'm like, no, I'm selling some of them. Don't worry. <laughs> Don't worry. <laughs> um, horror Funko. Funko, yes. I do have older ones. Um, Michael Myers. Um all the older ones, Chucky. But I, like I said, I'm I'm trying to, you know, thin out. So I do have older ones, and I'm keeping older ones. But I'm I'm not thinking about getting any more, <laughs> especially with all the Pennywise situation. That that's oh, yeah. that's like oh, so discouraging. Yep. yep. Where else? Where did you win the PlayStation? I know that was something else. <laughs> Matthew Cowley said dibs on Betty and Will. <laughs> <laughs> and that was one that sold out quick. They made a mistake. It all came out in the morning. So people were able to snatch a lot up in the morning. That's how I got it. <laughs> yep. That's how I, I got mine too. I'm at work and I'm like, what? Okay, let me get it. <laughs> okay, yeah, just buy it. This is weird. Okay. And then when it came out at two, it didn't last long. Minute, two minutes. Yeah. 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 And everybody thought they were going to cancel those orders, but they didn't. Nope. They honored them. They honored them. I think, uh, I don't know, for anyone in the chat that doesn't know the 
10 inch Indiana Jones with Idol will be on uh, the Disney shop at 3 a.m. Eastern time. Oh my gosh. I'm glad it's a 10 inch because I don't, I don't want, I don't have room for all these 10 inches. I don't have. It is a 10 inch. And then ECC, of course, has the metallic limited at 2000. Yeah. That one would be cool. But it's just, be. it's just the, the idol that he's holding is, is metallic. He's got a, he, the whip is with him and he, yeah, he's holding the idol. Yeah, but I think only the idol is uh, metallic, or is the whole. Uh, I think the whole thing on the ECCC one is metallic. Okay, that's pretty cool. Oh yeah, it, it's cool. But man, it's a, when you're at ECC at a con, you just couldn't imagine that big of a box and then having to ship it back. But yeah, yeah. I feel for people, uh, what, like, uh, let's see, Captain Pops and, uh, of course, Ed over at Pop Drunk, who had the collection. That's their thing, is 10 inch pops. And it's, Ed I was feel saying, yeah, I've got to get it eventually. <laughs> oh, no, I don't have room. I got the thing, but I'm like, I need to return this because I, I don't want to get into this. Like, the only thing I need was one Deadpool and every single Star Wars they, they come out with. If they come out with Doctor Who, I might get it, but it's it's too much. Too much. Yeah, yeah, Star Wars is such a huge collection to do. Man, they're awesome. They are. How's it going, Johnny G? Hey, Johnny G. Um, I don't do pre-orders. <laughs> because, because you find so many mini pops cheaper later. Especially commons, it's like I don't have fear of missing out. <laughs> not at all, because yeah, not, I missed not, out not. for five years. <laughs> I missed out for five years, so and I'm fine. So I'm like, I'll wait. Yep, it's commons will commons will come for all of. I mean, for me, I do a lot of mystery box. I I stay away from it unless it's something I just absolutely have to have. Yeah, yeah. Like Michael okay. Gordon, or uh, you know, I saw the new Minions pops, Minions two, and I was like, oh man. <laughs> But I'll wait. I'll wait. They'll come. Yeah, I wait because, like, like the Umbrella Academy, I, I felt the need to get it right when it came out, and I was like, no, let me wait. Right now, there are six dollars at Walmart website, yep. so it's like, if I wait, it's gonna be even cheaper. Yep. They're not gonna sell out, so you know when the pop is gonna sell out. Mm-hmm. It's hard for a common to sell. You know, you never really see that too often. Yeah. And then hot cash and all that stuff is the best time to get those and play the chase roulettes and stuff like that. Kitty Sam's word set world said, what pop would you like to see Funko make? I, it just came out ever since I started collecting, um, star Wars pops. I was, it, I was dumbfounded that they never did, um, Luke Skywalker with Yoda on his back. I'm like, why aren't they not making this? And they just made it. Yep. <laughs> so, I'm happy for now. <laughs> I like the Darth Vader with the mask coming down from the, I forget what movie that was. It was Empire Strikes Back or uh, the regular Star Wars. I, I like that pop. That's a cool pop. Um, someone asked if I have pop rights. Carrie Smith. Yes, I do. Not many. I have the Breaking Bad one. Um, I have uh, Deadpool with the chimichanga. What color is that? The cool one. I think it's the yellow one. The yellow one. Um, I had. I have Incredible Credit Girl with the with the bike. I have, maybe, cool. I have maybe six of them. Yeah. Flocked Falcor from Never. Uh, that would be a cool one, Kitty Sam's World. Falcor from yeah. Never Ending Story. That would be fun. Yeah. yeah I I like. I mean, we I, a lot of us always saw Spaceballs is just one I think all of us would love to see. Yeah. Probably well, but we'd love to see it. Do you have a Tom Baker? No. Uh, Doctor Who pops. Um, I also missed out on, on a bunch, especially the the companions. I don't have. I only have one of the companions, and I have River Song, but I don't have Tom Baker on or John. No. Ooh, what is your favorite ad icon? My favorite ad icon. The ones I have are the one of all of them. Uh, okay. I, I don't know if you're going to say it. 
So from the ones I have, I don't know. I love all of them. So hard. Maybe the Energizer Bunny. That's a cool one. Yeah. From the ones I don't have would be Toucan Sam. I also like, like Frankenberry, but I don't... I don't remember because everybody knows that I was born in Brazil. I was raised in Brazil. So um, I never knew Frankenberry there. I don't think they had the cereal there. So it's yeah, like... I've only seen it ever come out in the stores at Halloween now. Yeah. I don't know. Now, Tony the Tiger, yes. I think Tony is one of uh, all of our favorite ones. We all love Tony the Tiger. Yeah. Love Tony. What else? Which pop brings the most childhood memories? Um, I would say all the Thundercats and uh, Masters of the Universe, because I used to watch those all the time. My yep. favorite part. My favorite part of He Man was finding Oracle. <laughs> That's cool. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah. I think we all remember He-Man and uh, Transformers and Voltron and Ma Mask would be cool. I don't know why they ever do Mask. Some people don't remember Mask. But it's so funny because we have Boomerang and we try to have our kids watch and we're like, oh, we cannot let them watch this. This is not, <laughs> this is not good at all for kids. <laughs> and Jeff Brad, I did see selling on Macari, PBG, Instagram. It all depends. Macari charges 10%, but they have the shipping that's all like, included. Uh, Whatnot's another new selling app for anyone out there. Um, check it out. Uh, I know Curtis from Mystery Pop did an interview with him. Um, you can go on his channel and check that out. But uh, I have not joined, I have not done Whatnot yet. Uh, I don't like money going into PayPal accounts for tax and reasons and everything like that. It just gets too much. I do too much with PayPal. Um, Elizabeth asked, what's the thing that I miss most from Brazil? Family. Uh, because the food, I can get it here. We can make Brazilian food. We have everything here. So food, I don't miss. Places, I don't miss. Mostly family and friends. And I haven't been. <laughs> <laughs> In almost 20 years. Oh, wow. They come here, but we, we don't go. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, what else? Pop place. Yes, I want the Flock uh, Charmander. That's one that when I go there, a lot of people are getting already, so I'm kind of jealous. Awesome pop place. Yeah. Oh yeah, gummy bears. We all. I mean, I remember every Saturday morning, gummy bears bouncing here and there and everywhere. My daughter is watching, and I have, I have to watch with her because I don't know if it's there's something bad. <laughs> I think gummy bears was always was always okay. Yeah, I think it was okay, but my husband likes all the bad ones. I'm like, you cannot watch Tom and Jerry with them. They're, <laughs> day. They're gonna start doing the same thing. Don't don't watch that. <laughs> they their favorite is Chili Willy. They love. Chili. Too, yeah, I like that. Yep. Yeah. Baron, Baron St. Bears would be cool. Yeah. I don't think we have more the pops of those yet. Uh, I am doing a giveaway because I was sure we are going to get 400 here. So I am doing a giveaway for uh, 450. So once I hit 450, um, it's on my latest video. You can go and take a look and enter the giveaway. Tom and Jerry. Yeah, Tom and Jerry. Funko Pops. Cool. Oh, I don't. I got the peanuts ones. They're cool too. Yeah. Now the one, the one collection that I'm like, these are the ugliest pops ever, but I love the show is Family Guy. Yep. Those are the weirdest pops that I've ever yep. seen. <laughs> so weird. I'm with it. It's so hard. Some, some of them they do can do good, and then other ones it's like, oh, it's just so bad. It's like yeah. I love Monsters Incorporated, and then when I see Sully, it's like it just doesn't work for. It just doesn't look right to me. It's because I think they want to keep you know the style, but they could do something different. Yes. It's okay to change it up a bit. Um, 
Yes, I do have musician pops. I have um, Queen. I have two um, uh, Freddie Mercury's. I have, I'm missing Michael Jackson. That's the one that I feel so bad that I wasn't, I wasn't buying any pops at the time. But I do have uh, Nirvana. I have Kiss, all the good ones. All the real rock ones. <laughs> the original Kiss? Yes. Oh, wow. No, not, good... the, no, not the original. I wish. I wish. I have the new, the new wave, which is okay. Oh, yeah. Yeah. It's the whole group. At least is, is something. Yep. <laughs> and I have Prince. I think I have two of the Prince Pops. Aerosmith's coming out soon, and I'm getting Aerosmith. It's one of my favorite bands. Oh, there's Batman Popster. What's going on? Great live yeah. on Friday. That was epic. I loved it. That was so funny. I was. It was too funny. I, I never. I, and they even said it too. They never thought he Magoo would get into character like that. And it was no. oh, man. He was and good. He was, he was so into it because he's. I think he was, he had to get out of it. <laughs> <laughs> I think he had to go out and like, okay, see. <laughs> yes, that was good. It was good. He's he's too fun. I love Magoo. Oh, he's something else. I, I, I tell him, I said, Magoo, let's do a, a video out on the porch. And he's like, it's the winter. I said, yeah, I know. I live in Minnesota. Yeah, I know. <laughs> you can see how you do. It'd be kind of funny. He's too funny. He is. He is. Ozzy Osbourne. Um, I was never into um, the band. I love Ozzy Osbourne because I used to watch the show. Yep. Never into the band. Um, in Brazil, uh, he was like satanic or something. My mom would be like, you cannot listen to this music. <laughs> <laughs> he is from the devil. <laughs> but I love Ozzy Osbourne. He's something. He is something. Hey, Anthony. Oh, yeah, Anthony's here. What is going on, my friend? Anthony's awesome. He is. He's something else. He I love last last year he started to do some mystery boxes, and he's like, I got it already. I got it already. And we tell him, Anthony, if you're going to do mystery boxes, don't buy commons. <laughs> he can't help it. He can't help it. Oh, no, he buys everything. No, he does. He does. He did, he did an Instagram where he, did, he got his first uh, soda. This will be the first, and I'll definitely get more. <laughs> Fun, fun story. I was looking for the Death uh, Death Watch Mandalorian. Mm -hmm. And I couldn't find it anywhere. My GameStop kept saying, oh, it's coming. Oh, it's not coming. And I said something on his Instagram. I was like, oh, I wish he's giving away this pop because he was doing a giveaway. And I wish he's giving away this pop because I really wanted it. And he's like, he just came to the DM and he's like, hey, I have an extra one. I'm sending it to you. I'm like, what? How much? And he's like, no, I'm just sending it to you. That's Anthony. Yep. And yeah. I, I've been following him. I have been subscribed to him and watching his videos for a long time. And I was like, he's he's even better than I thought. Oh, yeah. Yeah. He's, yeah, he's, he's got a heart of gold. Yep. And a cool, cool thing. I, I can't remember how long. It was a while ago, but he does a video where it shows his room. And it is something else to see that. Well, I have to see that one. Maybe it's an oh, old. Yeah. I forget how long ago it was, but it was a while. But he, he shows from his door when he walks in to his desk, around the desk and everything. I mean, it's filled. It's unbelievable. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my goodness. I have to yeah. see this one. Yeah, it's a good one. Yeah. Great guy. Yeah. Well, check it out, guys. Hey, yo, Jay. What's going on, Jay? Oh, yeah, Anthony. Do a new one, and we'll, we'll be there. We're going to be watching it. <laughs> For sure. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Brazil has no... Brazil is... it's If you try to collect pops in Brazil, it's not a good thing. Because the prices are inflated. Um... If it's a hundred dollars here, it will be like five hundred dollars there for one pop. So it's like it's not even one yeah. of the guys. Who, one of my subscribers, he's from Brazil, and he he says it's really hard. So not fun at all to collect in Brazil. 
What else? Does anyone know if two Ps are coming back? Um, I have talked to Jess. Uh, I, I honestly, I don't know. I don't know. I know they have a lot of stuff going on in their, in their lives and everything like that, guys. So for I think the foreseeable close future, I, I don't think so. Oh, uh, Yoja. Yeah, I heard the Ice Cube is in the Impala is out. Yes, Flash Ray. Shipping to Brazil, it is crazy. It's better if they come pick it up. <laughs> they can come visit, and, you know, buy some other stuff and bring it to Brazil. Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. If you guys want to see Steven, he does do a podcast with his brother, uh, Sith Talkers, I believe, or it's just a it's adult rated, no no kids, and uh, it's a Star Wars podcast. So if you want to check Steven out, he still does that. Not yet, uh, Pop Place. Anyone else has any more questions? I'm an open book. <laughs> <laughs> At some degree. <laughs> and they'll ask anything. <laughs> and guys, giveaways and everything like that. Julian's going to do one at 450. I'll do the 3K next Sunday night. So for oh, anyone, way, congratulations again. Thank you. Thank very, you. very cool. Yeah, you remember all the numbers. Where you were at when, that, when it hit. Uh, I actually was on Anthony's... Um, live when i hit 1k i'll never forget that shouts out to anthony if he's still in here so yeah he's a he's a great guy great guy that must be awesome it was neat you get to, it was neat to meet this year meeting some people you know i went down to see um see sean with Le hashtag larry this past year uh took the trip to indianapolis and got to see two peas and got to meet clint and hang out with them at a colts game uh, so yeah definitely very cool one word in Portuguese. What do you want to hear in Portuguese? I can say a whole sentence if you want. <laughs> Elizabeth wants me to do something in Portuguese, but then I'm like, all my viewers only speak English. <laughs> <laughs> Hello? It's almost like um, Spanish, but in Spanish is hola, in Portuguese is hola. Okay. Or oi. When you say oi, it's Hello. <laughs> Anthony, maybe we'll have to do a, a second uh, live WrestleMania thing like we did last year. Let me know. That would be cool. Yeah, we had fun doing it last year. We did it before the event and talked over the matches. It was a lot of fun. Anthony's a trip. He is, he is a great guy. Yes. I was so busy I hadn't hit the, the like button yet. <laughs> But I do it every time I start watching a video. Oh, I appreciate it. Thank you. Yeah. 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 Anthony, let me know. We'll do it. Why do they put the belt on? Well, I think you guys all knew why that. Uh, I actually asked Ed that because Ed being in the wrestling business, I asked that. And uh, it was because they do not want Roman. Roman Reigns is going to win the belt and they're not going to do that. Uh, they did not want the Fiend to lose at WrestleMania to Roman Reigns. So they thought it would be less heat doing it this way. I know nothing about wrestling. I only I know like The Rock, me. which... Oh, you can't beat The Rock. Yeah. Absolutely. The Rock and uh, what was his name? The, the Just came in. See how much I know? Uh, oh, yeah. The Hulk Hogan. Hulk Hogan. Yes. <laughs> That's all I know. <laughs> yep. Well, guys, it is 1030, so I'm sure Juliana's got an early morning with kids and everything like that. Oh, yeah. In my morning, I have another kid throwing up, so oh, <laughs> I think he's, he's he when he was a baby, he had um, a milk allergy. Mm -hmm. I think he's coming back because anytime he drinks milk, he's throwing up now, so. I have and both then, of my, both of my kids were like that. 
And that's his favorite thing in the world. Chocolate milk. So, <laughs> not fun. <laughs> yeah, that's a tough one. All right, guys. So I thank everyone for coming. I thank everyone for supporting Geeky Mama Bear. Juliana, thank you for joining me. Whenever you want to do it again, let me know. For sure. Yes. Thank you for having me over. And Absolutely. Time. This yeah. is fun. I Absolutely. love eating lives. I'm still a little, you know, afraid of doing my, my own life, but it will come. <laughs> it's easy peasy. Easy peasy. It's a lot of fun. And you ever want to do any kind of battles, let me know. We could have some fun. Oh, yeah, for sure. Always fun to do that. I love battles. I was just in one of the Pops with Purpose box. And it was Those were great bo they were great boxes. Shout oh, out yeah. to Michael and Faith. I think they were here earlier. And it was funny because they when we opened on a live and they were like, oh, my gosh, you don't have the value. And I'm like, don't worry about it. This is for fun. I, I reached more than what I paid oh, for. Yeah. Uh, what someone paid for because someone got me the box. They don't want me to tell the world. <laughs> so, uh, but then they today I got another pop. And I was like, what's this? And it was the Abraham Lincoln that I wanted. I was like, what? Wow. And then they was they were like, oh, you didn't reach the value that we're planning. So we just sent another one. <laughs> so that was awesome. That is good. That yeah. is good. Yeah. So Mama J, uh, DJ Funko, and Danster TV, it seems like I won now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right, guys. Well, we're going to get out of here. Thank you for joining us. I will Thank see you guys. guys next Sunday. Again, moderators, everyone, link up Ginky Mama Bear. Go support her. Check her out. Check the videos out. And uh, give away at 450. Yep. So awesome. Congrats on 400. Good luck to 450. I'm sure it will come very quick. Yes. All right, guys. I'll leave you with the parting word. Anything you want to say? No, just I just want to thank everyone for subscribing, all the love. Um, I try to talk to everyone. Everybody knows if they come on DM, I try to talk to them. I do have three kids, a job, and this <laughs> this is this is another full time job. But I do my best. I do my best to answer everyone and to talk to everyone. And to show to show some love because there is no YouTube channel without the, the subscribers. Absolutely, so they're the most important part. So lots of love to everyone and thank you. And thank you guys. We will see you again. Uh, have a wonderful week, a wonderful rest of your night for Sunday, and uh, we'll see you live with Sean on Sean's channel on Thursday. And I'll be here live next Sunday for the big giveaways. Awesome. You guys, have a wonderful night. Thank you to Juliana. Go support thank her. You. And uh, we'll see you again, guys. Bye. Thank you, everyone.